So all I'm doing is really drawing. We don't remove the center line. We watch the we watch the profile of that center line. Okay. Now, look. This is high. This is low. We don't want to cut any more out of that. So we want to just keep pushing that back. So the, so this side equals this side. See how much difference that is? Now you got to remove all this material in here. All it is is drawing. And we've got this line in here, just like you were drawing on a piece of paper, right? Look, this is a little higher. So I can bring that back, and then I can build that edge right there. And so all I'm doing is drawing that edge three-dimensionally. So I'm just pushing that edge back, making sure that line matches up. See there? There? So that's got a long ways to go, to go back. So all we're doing is really just drawing. So I'm gonna work with that line, that line, that line, and that line. That's it, it's just drawing. So that's the top of the shoulder. I don't want to go below that. And we'll leave this for the shoulder and the back. That'll be fine. We won't take anything off there. But now I've got this shape to play with right here. And I just want this line is going rather parallel. So I need to like do something with it. So make it shift this way and then make it shift this way. Probably be a little more attractive. So it's gonna go that way and then that way. So it moves. So it's not just one coil. Now you can see it moving as one unified shape. That's what we're trying to do, is to get this broken upness, make it so it's not so broken up. You see along this edge, it's just too straight. So you've got to vary it a little bit. Repetition and variation. You'll probably still take out a big chunk of this. So what are you gonna do with your day? You gonna be a free man or prisoner? Make your own decisions or let an unelected foreign body tell you what to do? Well, I'm gonna be a free man today. Now last time we talked about this being flat. This peaks up here with this. It doesn't round like a cone, so I'm gonna take that off. Stay big. We started our serpentinata. We'll bring that into B next time. Let's get this pushing round.
Already, it's starting to round and it's feeling better. It's feeling good, there's no struggle. Just as in fabric, like I said before, you want to move to the side. That's drawing. I got that shape going in. Now I want to move to the side and round it. Give this some shape by taking away this. This is a boss. This is going to be a hollow boss. So, kind of boss, hollow boss. It's always a little better to stay on the boss side than the hollow side. But we want to make those curls look like something. So now I'll work it in from the side. 